Hey, that you just gotta see. A man's doorbell camera captured the moment flames began to engulf his condo. Firefighters say someone intentionally set this fire and another just 24 hours earlier. Those fires happened last week on Margaret Brown Street near South Sycamore Street. And while investigators work to find the person responsible, our Erica Lunsford spoke with the families who live there. Erica, they're trying to rebuild their lives after losing just about everything here. Yes, Siobhan, we first spoke to Frank Wolfarth last week right after his home caught fire. And, and then while speaking to him, he said he's thankful to have his life. And now while speaking to him today, after seeing his video doorbell camera, he says his gratitude for life has now expanded. Within this 30 second clip, you can just see how fast the intentionally set fire from a nearby property spread to the front porch of Frank Wolfarth's home. I started smelling all the smoke. Then I saw weird flashing lights in, in my house. Then I realized something was, was wrong. Just the night before, firefighters worked to extinguish flames at this building just feet away from Wolfarth's home. Charlotte fire investigators say Thursday morning, another fire was intentionally set at this building, but this time it spread to homes nearby. Wolf Arth also shared pictures of the damage to his home, his living room covered in ash, and his car completely totaled. Wolf Arth says seeing this video really put into perspective how close he was to losing his life. My camera, ring camera, showed 1.55 a.m. when my house caught fire. I got out at 2.15, so that told me it was 20 minutes from the moment the fire hit my place until I got out. So, uh, sorry. I'm getting emotional for a second, but um, I, uh, I recognized right then and there that I was very lucky to be alive. I'm guessing, I don't even know, maybe minutes away or maybe less than that from actually surviving. We have a link on our website on how you can help Wolfarth. In the meantime, uh, Charlotte Fire Department, they're asking for anyone with any information on how this fire started to contact Crime Stoppers. Reporting in Charlotte, Erica Lunsford, WBTV on your side. Video just gives you chills every time you see it. Erica, thank you. Jamie? Uh,